What's up everybody? It is day 39 of the road to 200 pounds. So uh, I beasted yesterday. I got into the gym and I just kept going and going and going. I was like the Energizer Bunny. I was so happy. Um, I matched the intensity that I used to do before. Um, <clears throat> so I, I am I am happy with that. Hopefully uh, this will be a regular thing. Uh, I'm going to continue on the intensity that I had before. Um, so I'm excited. Uh, I'm excited about that. I hope that's the case. Um, <clears throat> so I, I beasted. I, I went into the gym for, I kind of didn't really uh, keep track. I didn't really like look at the clock or whatever. It was over three hours. Um, but uh, but yeah, I, I went in and I warmed up with the, with the, uh, <clears throat> with the stationary, or the, the, um, the one where you sit down, the bike. Anyways, whatever the hell it's called. Anyways, I warmed up with that. I went until I burned 25 on, or 20, 250 calories. Then I went and I went to the machine area and I went through every single machine that had to do with legs. And I did three sets, <clears throat> the highest weight possible. And if I did all three sets and I didn't fail, I did a fourth set. So, uh, I went until my muscles couldn't take it. I hopped on the elliptical and burned another 500 calories. And then I went back to the bike and burned 250 calories. Here is my goals. When I go into the gym, and this helps me beast as hard as I do, I have three goals. Okay. Goal number one is I burn a thousand calories in just cardio just the cardio okay I weight lift too but a thousand calories and just the cardio I don't care how much I burn when I'm lifting weights I don't even worry about that but I burn a thousand calories in cardio well goal number two is is hitting every machine goal number three is that I do not leave the gym it doesn't matter if I've hit my other two goals okay I do not leave the gym until I weigh the same in my gym clothes and my shoes as I did that morning. Okay. And now this, this is if you're fasted, if you've eaten before you go to the gym, don't do this. You're going to kill yourself. Only do it if you're fasted because when you have food in your stomach, that can be a bunch of pounds depending on what you ate. And that it just doesn't work that way. Um, but if you're fasted, that is a goal that I have. I don't leave the gym until I weigh the same in my gym clothes as I did that morning. Okay. And as you'll see, when I post my weight, I dropped almost three pounds that way. So, uh, having those three goals and making sure I hit all three of them helps me to push the limits. I went in, I hit every machine, you know, I probably burned at least... 1500 calories on on those machines because I lift heavy I lift heavy so and and I lift till I fail out till I can't actually complete the reps so um, and also I will add if I fail in the middle of a set if I'm going for 10, 10 reps, which is about the norm that I do. If I'm going for 10 reps and I can only complete five before I fail out, I come back and I keep going. If I do another two and fail out again, I come back. Do another two, fail again, come back, do one. I always complete my sets, always. Um, also, another quick tip I'll tell you. If, if you're interested in bodybuilding at all, um, those type of workouts, uh, when you're using the machines, do not let the weight rest. Okay? And do not, when you're doing like leg workouts or whatever, or, or even arms, you know, don't lock your knees, don't lock your elbows. Okay? Because the way you're going to have the most hypertrophy is if there is consistent and constant stress on that muscle, okay? 
So when you lock your elbow or lock your knee, you're allowing yourself to rest that little bit. Okay? And if you let the weight drop and rest, you're resting there. So if you don't lock up your elbows, you don't lock up your knees, you don't let the weight rest, you have a consistent stress on your muscles until the end of the set. And that is what uh, builds muscle, is that that consistent stress on the muscle. Um, so yeah, that's uh, that's that's the basics. You know, I'll, I'll, I can get into later uh, other stuff that I do, um, other tips that I have learned and stuff. Uh, you know, but that's that's pretty much the basis of uh, of how I succeed with weightlifting. Um, so yeah, uh, I'd also I was also gonna mention. Well, first before I forget. Mika Fasting Weight Loss. Mika! Congratulations on having Dr. Berg show up in your live stream. That is awesome. I couldn't be more happy for you. That That is wonderful. I'm so happy for you. Um, that that's, that's cool. Okay, so bought batteries for my scale. I'm going to start weighing everything out. I'm not going by cups. I'm not going by teaspoons, tablespoons. I'm not going by measurements. I'm going by weight because then I know it's exact. So I can track as, uh, as precise as possible. I also got wireless headphones um, so that I can watch you guys' videos in the gym or I can, you know, listen to music or whatever. And that's going to that's gonna help me in, enjoy my workouts more. And, uh, and I'll, I'll get you guys some watch time and um, be able to... to uh, multitask and support you guys more and so i'm excited about that um yeah i'm getting all set you guys have a wonderful day great job on your weight loss guys a bunch of you are killing it um i'm so happy to have found you guys this has been an amazing experience and i i couldn't find the words to thank you guys so um yeah guys Go find people, reach out. Uh, you know this this community of people that I've experienced. It's just uh, it's it's a huge huge help. So go reach out to people. Go find people. There's over eighty in my subscriptions right now. Not all of them are people who have just started a weight loss journey, but probably about 90% of my subscriptions are people that are, are also certain a weight loss journey. So go find some support and go support some people. Spread the love. We're going to be all in this together, you know. 2019, we're going to kill it. But we're going to kill it most efficiently when we love one another and band together. So let's do it. Uh, have a great day, guys. We'll talk to you tomorrow. Hey, you. Subscribe to my channel. Out that dude, out that dude, out that dude.